So you gonna help or you just gonna judge? Oh, judging doesn't require hands, boo. Bitch? Oh, you noticed. Know Look at you getting all smart and stuff. Hey, baby, can you make me some coffee? I'm running late. I already made it, babe. Hurry up. Hurry up. Oh, you all are just so sweet. You just better. You know, you can have a man like that too if you do little stuff like this. Nah, I'm good. You can go and keep that to your damn self. Okay. Uh, love you. Babe, 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 Your food. Um, oh. Mwah. Have a good day. Hi, Keisha. You know, I swear that man don't like me. What's not to love? Oh, bitch. <laughs> oh, you noticed. You know what? I'm hungry, so I'm eating his food. You know what? It's okay. You can just take this. I see why he left it. What's wrong with my angel? Come on, bro, you got this. They brought you to LA for this. You're the man. I know, I know, I know. Ugh. But I've been burnt before. I know, it's okay. Just take a deep breath. Go to your happy place. You know, think about your husband with those shorts that you like. What? Like, how do you know my husband has shorts like that? And secondly, what the hell? Um, three, every healthy marriage has sexy shorts. And I just assumed that he'd be the one wearing them. And why is that? Because I've seen your legs, dude. And I don't even know how you can get those suit pants on with those giant ham hock thighs of yours. Let alone sexy shorts? Mm -mm. As fun as this is, I gotta go. <sighs> go get him, baby. Don't forget about the shorts. <laughs> They accept them at PetSmart. This isn't PetSmart, sir, and uh, we do not accept expired coupons. You know what? I am done with you college kids. Let me speak to the manager. I'm actually 30 years old, sir, and I am the manager. Uh, but we still won't accept those expired coupons. Girl, please. You uh, wait, I'm gonna no stop you there. I'm gonna stop you right there. It's either you can purchase these items or you can kindly leave the store. Thank you, sir, come again. I love it when they shade you, boo. It's always so, so good. What's going on in here? Nothing much. Uh, sorry about that bad uh, Yelp review, though, Miss Carter. It's all right. I didn't know nothing about Yelp until about a month ago. <laughs> Why don't you come in the back room? I want to have a word with you. All right. Keisha, you gonna watch the store? Y'all need some help? Ask him. You've only been here a short while, but you've done great things in my little shop here. Thank you, man. You gave me a chance. How would you like another chance? To do what, sir? You might have guessed I'm getting old, right? Maybe just a little. I've put everything I've had into this little shop. And I'm tired. I need someone to run it and not just be a manager. And what about Keisha? I love my baby. But that bitch is crazy. And you know it. She needs somebody to keep her calm and grounded. I'm gonna leave the company to her, but I'd feel a lot happy if you were here running things. I mean, is, is she okay with that? Cause like, I just got here. I'm, I'm really not trying to step on any toes. It was my idea. You sure? No, I'm just giving you part of my daddy's company because it sounds really nice. And of course, I'm sure. Look, me and you both know that I'm not about to deal with these customers and you have a great vision for this company. So just do me a favor and let me sit back here and do the paperwork. Please, please. 
I don't even know what to say. <laughs> yes is usually pretty appropriate in situations like this. I mean, unless we're in an the alleyway, then it's a solid maybe. <laughs> you see why I want you running things? Yeah, but thank you, sir. Truly. My pleasure. Um, Breton, there's a white lady with pink hair and a pink dog out there, and I'm not about that. <laughs> Look at him. It was a shorts, wasn't it? Would you let the shorts go, please? Okay, stop right there. You never let the shorts go, bro. Some of the greatest nights in the history of my life were because of sexy shorts. That's great. So, you got the promotion. You got a nice raise. Tell me about it. We, you know, yeah, got the promotion. Probably can afford something a little fancy, like, um, oh, Ikea. Oh, okay, I see you. Also heard you got invited to the fancy manager's dinner party tonight. Good job. Wait, how did you know that? <laughs> the guy that prints the invitations, we're good. Okay, who don't you know? Michael Jackson. Still missing. Oh, it's time for sexy talk with the husband, huh? Tell him I said hi. Uh, yeah, sure. Hold on one second. Oh. Hey, babe. Oh, you sound happy. I am, I am. So, Carter. Hold on, hold on. Hey, Keisha, can you go get the door? The UPS man is here. Ooh, it's that fine delivery man, too. <laughs> go on floor to get my package. Oh, sorry, babe. Yeah, so, uh, Carter, he made me part owner of the store. For real? That's great. Thank you, thank you. What did they say to you? Well, I, I got the promotion and everything, um, and we got invited to a party this weekend. Uh. -huh. So you just want to be around all these little stuck-up rich people, huh? Well, probably some bland-ass food, too. You know, I haven't told you that I love you and you are so... Calm down. Calm all that down. I'll go. I feel like stunning on bitches anyway. I, you know, this is why I love you. I love you, too. And don't be out too late tonight. We can celebrate. Ooh, oh, their daddy daddy didn't bring I really do not like her. <laughs> she knows. She better. Look, anyway, I gotta get back to work. Okay, babe, I'll talk to you later. You need your back banged out. You've been so busy with moving and work. I need my back. Oh, you like that make sweet love stuff, don't you? And you don't. No, I like him in the bed wondering about his life with choke marks on his neck. What? You ain't ever ruined somebody's life before? Bitch, no. And what are you doing to these boys? I mean, it's not fun unless, you know, somebody gets slapped. Slap? Yes. Oh, come on. You mean Angel ain't never, you know, like. <laughs> I fight his ass like a grown man in the street. I wish he would. But he's so big. I mean, you ain't never had him tear it up before? Been there. Done that. I like passion. I want to be held. I want to be kissed. Oh, and you love that pretty, pretty princess. That's boring, okay? You need to break the bricks off of his ass, you know, mm. so he can't even think. Keep some obedient. Plus, Angel looks like he'd be fun to break in. That's why he's my husband. And that's why he's gonna cheat on your ass. Cheat some girl, boo. Look, it's not like we don't have sex Period. But you need more than that, okay? It needs to be nasty. It needs to be loud. You know, a little bit painful. Painful? Yes, bitch. Have you never had him wandering around the 100 acre wood thinking if he gonna die tomorrow? Not a 100 acre wood. Oh, bitch, you're a sex failure. Um, do you have this one in all rhinestones? You're a Scorpio, huh? How did you know? I got a special collection for you over here. Come on, girl. 100 acre wood. I'm sure you know that 
Yes. What are we smiling about? Uh, just got a promotion. Or you were talking dirty to your husband again. You know what, you are a walking HR disaster. Oh, Angel, just let me live vicariously through you, please. Or you can just get some from your wife. <laughs> okay, hold on a second, let me work on that. Uh, hello, can I get two tickets to Boring Town? Yeah, location, my bedroom. Yeah, well, thank you so much. And no, we've been married for over 10 years, dude. There's only so many times you can look around a museum and act interested. 10 years and you don't have any old war stories? <laughs> war stories? Uh, no, it's just sex. It's not D-Day. Well, not typically. It's no fun unless there's an explosion or two. Explosions? Woo! What do y'all get into? Nothing you ain't gotta worry about. Oh, okay, boo-boo. <sighs> How do you know that I'm not the bottom? <laughs> Dear Lord, please help this man. Motherfucker. Babe, babe, slow down. We're not going anywhere. I know I'm about to make your legs go numb. <laughs> Aren't we supposed to be celebrating? Yes, at first, but I mean, or my legs can go numb. Cool. <laughs> no, like, can't we just take our time? I mean, it's been like a month, and we got a lot of stress that we have to relieve. Yeah, but I'd like to be able to walk tomorrow. Okay, well then, I'll bottom first then. <laughs> but I said what I said. And if you don't like anything, Shh. I'm about to... My first choice. <laughs> Neither was my husband. <laughs> Danica McNeil. Ben Howard, very nice to meet you. Howard? My husband just promoted an angel, Howard. Are you two acquainted? Very. That's my husband. <gasps> oh, how adorable. I am so glad the gays can get married now. Lord knows the idea of marriage needs a good makeover. There you are. Oh, hey, hey uh, Mrs. McNeil, I need to talk to him for the guys real quick. You know, they want to chat it up with the good old. Oh, I <laughs> All right, okay. Bye. 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 That was close. You almost snapped. You lucky. Can we leave now? I can't even get tipsy off these little weak drinks. Babe, hey, hold on. I got to still talk to the guys a little bit. Have you tried the rum cake? It got rum in it. Mm, how much rum? Don't get your hopes too high. I hate you. Okay. Bitch. Oh, what happened? I almost snapped some bitch's edges, but she was the boss's wife. Anyways, this dude at the party is gorgeous. Bitch. Pictures or it didn't happen. I'm not gonna take a picture of him. Oh my god, well then describe him. I need this tea. Fine as fuck. Please, do not ever sext. He's cute. 
young though. Yes, you gotta break them young. Me and Angel have been talking about trying to threesome. Yes, bitch, do it. I mean, double team him and corrupt the youth. You need Jesus. And he can get some too. Tom, I got that biblical good good. I cannot with you. Mm. That bad? I don't know if it was the black jokes or the size jokes. <laughs> I may have something that'll make you feel better. Huh? Right, so, there's this pretty little thing over here. No, top right here. Oh, oh. Yes, yeah. Cutie over there, he's been eye banging us all night long. Okay. Damn, confidence boosted. <laughs> That's not it. Not all of it. Wait, you suggesting we. Yep. Okay, he's cute. You think you can still pick him up? Well, you know it's been a minute. Excuse me, my game is nice. I locked you down for life. To be fair, your ass did all the work. Mm. My ass, huh? Uh-huh. Love you. So I'm guessing you're about to tell me to stop looking at your man. Not at all. He's gorgeous. You should wait till he turns around, though. For real? Ass is biblical. I'm good at worship. I bet. Brenton. Chase. Very nice to meet you. You know, he actually looks a lot better naked, though. <laughs> I'm sure you do, too. Your man is not the only one with a nice looking ass. Well, we were thinking what you might look like naked. <laughs> So long as it's at your place. We can work with that. We'll be leaving here in an hour. I'll be here. See you there. Oh, I love the way he I fucked you when you just walked away. You ready to go, huh? Oh, God, I love you. Yes. Girl, you almost got dealt with. Oh, boy, bye. You live in a white suburb. You'd be arrested before they could say there's black people barbecuing in the park. Why aren't you at work? I'm gonna go, but you are answering your phone and I need those deets. So that's why you're using my backyard like a creeper? Yeah. And don't you dare start singing. They still sleep. Oh, bitch, he didn't put two of y'all to sleep. Yes. No, you, you stupid. <laughs> His name is Chase. <laughs> He's an actor, he's 24, and he's a little greedy. Oh, yes, those are the best kind. You know, they're like the little Energizer bunnies of sex. Oh, oh my God, I know, right? And bro, it was so smooth too. It didn't matter if he was topping or bottoming. That little Negro put in work. Oh my God. Can I borrow him after y'all done? He's gay. Y'all got all the good toys. <laughs> Not even. Anyways. It was fantastic. He kept looking into my eyes and telling me how beautiful I was. And he had really soft lips too. He just felt like perfect. Hold it, bitch. Uh-uh. What? Pump the brakes and kick his little ass out right now. What the hell are you talking about? I'm saying that this is not a freshly banged glow. This is the dick got me catching feelings glow and you need to stop it and set it on fire right now. <sighs> Bitch, bye. Ain't nothing here saying they got feelings for anyone. All I'm saying is I like the way he handles his business. Well, you need to stop sleeping with him and I am so serious about that. That is really not up to you. Brett and I, we talked about it and if we want to bring him back over again, ain't got nothing to do with you. First of all, don't come for me unless I send for you, peasant. Second of all, I'm just trying to give some sage level wisdom up in this piece. I'm not saying that you can't get your three-way freaky sneaky on, but just don't do it with that little Negro in there. First of all, bitch, you're in my castle. And second of all, who you calling a peasant? I'll stick it in whoever, whenever, and in front of whoever the fuck I want to, and you will deal with it. Don't threaten me with a good time, okay? Because I'll sit and watch the whole way through. Don't you got some customers to scare off or something? Okay. Out! Your wish has been granted, sir. Bready baby. 
I'll see you at work. How do you deal with her? She means well. I'll take your word for it. But you were amazing last night. So were you. You know, I wouldn't mind inviting Chase over again. You know, I wouldn't either. That boy was. Wow, man, let me get this. Hey, hey, what you doing? You not going for our guest? I had to satisfy two men. I had to build up an appetite. Look, go ahead and wake them up, and I'll be done here soon. Good morning. Oh, good morning. Thank God I ain't got to go woke up, man. Hey, you so lazy. Leaving already? Sorry. I got to get back to my place. I got an audition for a TV show. Damn, that smells good, though. Well, you know, we can give you some to go if you call us again. Oh, I definitely will. Damn. Right? That boy is smooth. I think we like him. Mm-hmm.